made you decide to, to do an engineering course at the Northern Regional College? So I did my GCSEs and probably like should have maybe considered like moving on to something else other than ISs because I kind of was like, oh, this isn't for me anymore because I kind of struggle in that exam sort of environment, but just continued on at ISs anyway. And in Upper Sixth, I did work experience in an engineering firm and really, really enjoyed it. So kind of was like, oh, maybe this is the sort of thing for me. Like, maybe I'll try and do something along them lines, see how it goes. So just finished off my AS levels um, in school and then could have, like, I did well in GCSEs and A-levels, so I could have, like, stayed on and did A-levels in school, but I just knew it wasn't really for me. So then our seeing that an open day was coming up at Northern Regional College, and because I live locally to here, it was, like, it's kind of handy for me. So... Um, came down to the open day just to learn a bit more about the level three engineering course that I'm doing now and kind of thought oh yeah I'll try that and see how it is and yeah I'm really really enjoying it now. So what what kind of subjects are you doing in the course that you're, you're really enjoying? So in first year I really enjoyed doing the CAD and the engineering drawing because it kind of challenged my creative side a bit more um, and then this year I am doing a project unit, which is kind of sort of the same thing. It's challenging my creative aspects, but like being able to actually like try and like solve a problem in the workshop and make it more like user friendly and stuff. It's actually really like it's really challenging, and actually really enjoy like challenging myself and putting it more into like what I would want to do. Yeah. So more sense. practical based yeah. than than just kind of theoretical. Yeah. Any advice for girls wanting to, to enter the world of engineering or how have you found it? Yeah, definitely. Like it's not as intimidating as a lot of girls think. Like I am the only girl in my class and like I feel like it's not that bad. Like I actually get along well with all the boys in my class and like actually was nominated to be the class representative so that means like if the boys have any problems or like need help and stuff, like I'm kind of their go-to sort of persons.